Hi, this is a spiritual crystal card reading for Sagittarius for the month of August. So let's see what is your main energy. So, main energy for Sagittarius for August. And this is purpurine. So, purpurine is, um, here you have the name, here, purpurine. So, it is like, I would say, first of all, because purpurine, of course, is also spiritual. It's, um, it's, it is, may connect, connect with your, a little bit with your main, male energy, I would say. So, this month you have the opportunity more to connect with the male energy, but also, I would say, have a look because maybe there is the opportunity for you this month to have somebody to help you or to find some information some people who have some information for you so maybe you can ask help somebody to help you it is um, it also may be that is something new for you that you may have some uh, new some new plans maybe there's something new that you want to do in life so this is your main energy if this is the case so anyway tune into it okay so if you already have been thinking about something new and you have some ideas what to do about it it's this month so let's see what is now for the first week first week is emerald so emerald of course is the wisdom of the heart so listen to your heart on the first week all your questions they have their answers in your heart your heart know it your inner wisdom knows everything so we connect with your inner wisdom if this is for the moment if it's a little bit difficult you can or wear an emerald or you can make an elixir of the emerald and drink it during the day a few drops uh, three four drops three four times a day so this will help you to reconnect let's go for to see what the second week has to tell us rhodonite rhodonite changes there are changes coming up to you so things are happening in your life that will change it's not the same anymore so maybe there was something that was a routine going on and this is breaking now something new is coming so everything is there for you it is available there if you want to do something new it's a good time it's a good time to do it it's also good for to work with other people let's go for the third week third week you have uh, crystal it's clear thinking so try to be aware not aware um, focus okay focus focus and get clear your thoughts clear don't confuse don't get all these confusions too many things in your mind in your brain and don't know what to do with it too many things just one thing at a time one step at a time concentrate focus focus where do you want to go what do you want to do and there you direct it's what you are Sagittarius you just put your aim and follow it follow it but always in harmony with the universal will so you're not pushing on something that is not good for you you're pushing something what is in harmony with your inner wisdom with your heart and with your clear thinking that you know that this is the right thing for you to do allow the changing the changements to happen in your life fourth week fourth week this is work so it may be that there are changes something is happening in your work that there is something that is actually very positive because it are all strong cards that are coming to you so it is this uh, inner wisdom it is changings it is clear thinking so use all this in your work maybe in your daily life or work on them to make them stronger let's see for the fourth week another card and this is aventurine so that's inner growth that's again your heart chakra so this month is very good for you to be connected with your heart chakra and to allow other people to help you allow other things to come to you so that if there is change something changing for you that it can come and that you can go with the flow of these changements so that you can move on let's see what's the message from the angels message from the angels and this is celestine 
and Celestine, here you are, Celestine. And this is like if there is sadness, if there is sadness in your heart and uh, don't allow it to stop you from moving on. Ask the angels to help you. Ask the angels to enlighten your path, to ask, to not to ask, to help you to find what is the best thing for you to do. But be in harmony, I would say, with the changings because of the Rodonite here. Allow it to come through. Okay? Allow it. Be in harmony with it. So if there's another message from the angels, yeah, and here you have diamonds. So tune in. Tune in into the universal energy. Tune in. Allow. You know, we are, it's, it, it helps sometimes, you know, to see ourselves not through the eye of the ego, but to see ourselves where we really are. We are just, if you put the ego away, we are this energy. So everything is energy. The plant is not much different from us. The only thing is that we have all this brain and this ego and this stomach and these things but the thing is actually from a plant to us when you go on an energy level and you embrace for example a tree or if you meditate with a plant there's the energy there's only energy there there's nothing else so if you look at it from that point of view the universe everything is energy planets, everything. So when you open up and you allow this to stream through you, everything, you are just everything. You are just one atom with other atoms dancing around. So when you just be this incredible thing, this nothing actually, this everything, when you are in that space, then there's nothing to fear. There's everything what, what is happening then in changings and um, whatever is happening in our daily life is actually just a futility. Well, it's very important. Don't misunderstand it. It's very important, this fertility, because that's why we decided to be here, for to live this fertility. But it's not the important. So if we bring in all this power, and we are all this power, then we look at it from another perspective. We can see at it from another point of view. And everything is relevant then. Everything becomes relevant. So then automatically you go into the stream. And what has to happen will happen. So is so. If you're fighting against it or if you're not fighting against it. So if changements are there just go with them you will see where they will bring you if there are people coming on your way and they can help you well of course accept if there are new ideas well have a look at it maybe they may be good maybe there are some some insights coming through something else you can do clear thinking focus clear thinking focus Wisdom of the heart, be there, be in the heart. And if it is for your work, be there, it's an inner growth. So maybe there's something to learn there on your work, your daily life. Maybe there's something you can bring wisdom in there. And doing it instead of just on the body level, doing it completely in harmony with body, soul, everything. Doing your work complete. Full. So, that's for you for uh, Augustus, for August. So, if you would like a personal spiritual crystal card reading or more information, um, meditation, healing meditation, EFT sometimes, you can contact me through my website. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.